Like if I were to boil down leadership and you think that it's a big word and you probably heard it a bunch and your family, friends might have said, hey, you need to be a leader. Here's what leadership is. It's those two things. If I could boil it all down, it's living by values and adding value. At Mabry, we're really excited this year to be implementing the Habitudes program, which is a leadership development program based on the research of Tim Elmore and the IY generation. I'm a real believer that the magic happens in middle school and we have this great opportunity to connect with our students and use images. Habitudes is using images and planting them in the heart and mind so that they become ideas about leadership that students will remember hopefully for the rest of their lives. A lot of people want to become leaders, but they don't know how to, and the thermostat and thermometer describes how you need to stand up, and it doesn't matter what people think of you, just do what you think is right and become a leader. What sticks out to me is people can either be a thermometer or a thermostat, and if you're a thermometer, you just go with the flow and kind of let things happen, and you kind of follow the crowd. If you're a thermostat, you can control what you do and kind of lead other people. This is interesting for me because it talks about how you don't want to be a thermometer and reflect, basically show what's around you. You want to be able to choose your own choices and not let people change what you think about yourself or anything. I enjoy listening to him because how he connected to the iceberg about um, leadership strategies. This is the image generation that we are teaching and the images that Dr. Tim Elmore provides make a great bridge between our regular curriculum and the students' lives and how leadership is important. The message that was said today really inspired me to be more strong of a leader, leader because um, past, these past few years I've had situations where I could lead but I wasn't strong enough to make a real impact a strong impact on other people, so this really inspired me to inspire others. I think our speaker had such a strong message for us. Um, our analogy was we have endless potential and we can always give as much as we can and we will always be filled. And his analogy showed so much uh, with the jar and the water and I think that it will show our students uh, so many other ways that we can lead. Always figure out how to build bridges with people instead of building walls. It is a complete joy to be a part of Mabier Middle School today for the 6th, 7th, and 8th grade uh, for growing leaders to partner with them to be able to be a part of teaching this Habitude curriculum. So today, uh, just seeing the, the eyes open and the minds illuminated around this idea of leadership character, uh, but also be able to set the climate, uh, becoming a thermostat, not a thermometer. And so it is a complete joy for me to be able to speak and to encourage uh, the middle school students today.